Welcome back to Living 808. The 2018 Rainbow Warrior football schedule is complete. After the release of the Mountain West Conference schedule last week, Hawaii has filled all the blanks. Here to talk about the schedule, none other than Rainbow Warriors head football coach Nick Rolovich. Thanks. Thanks for having me. Yeah, appreciate yeah, it. Always. Okay, so you guys started uh, your first year in Australia. You mm -hmm. guys went seven and seven, four and four and four in the conference. Went to a Hawaii Bowl, smashed your opponent, Middle Tennessee, in that one. Last year, not the great, greatest season, kind of a rebuilding year, and I think it was probably more of what most of the experts would have expected. Definitely not what you wanted. Three and nine. Tell me about uh, last year. Well, it was definitely not what we expected. You know, we probably, as, as a collective unit, maybe felt too good about ourselves after mm -hmm. the first year. Um, we were very much aware, kept harping on it, that we have the target now because we kind of made some noise the first year. So. Got a little dose of reality, and uh, you know, really nice to get back with the guys today. This morning was was a was a great workout, and I just texted the guys and said, "Hey, you guys, you guys made my day. You know, we're, we're on we're on a, we're on the good track now." Okay, 2018 football schedule is out. Um, tell me your initial thoughts. Let's take a look at the first five games sure. of, the, of the season. Um, and you started off by adding a conference game early on, Colorado Sorry. State, August 25th. Tell me about that. Well, you're looking at 13 games in a row with no bye. Um, Hawaii, we have the week zero exemption. We wanted to be able to use it and get a bye. Um, and we appreciate Colorado State moving. It's, a, it's the second year in a row they get to open their new stadium. Mm -hmm. um, it'll be good for, for our kids to see. And, and I think some of our fans will be going up there to kind of see this new stadium. And then you've got to take a long haul against academy teams, Navy, Rice, Army, and well, Duquesne. Let's well, Navy's coming here. And, yep. you know, it'll be great to have... Coach Kenny back. I mean, he really loves the islands. He stays in touch with us. Um, you know, that'll be special for him, I'm sure. And then, you know, you got to go to Army, who's, who's a team who's been very improved the last couple years. Um, got to get Rice in between those two m military academies and, mm -hmm. and end with Duquesne before we really get into the meat of the conference. Okay, the next five are all conference games except for the Independent and Brigham Young. You've got to go to BYU. Here's the next five. San Jose State, Wyoming, BYU, Nevada, a place that you know very well. Uh, they'll be coming here. So tell me about the next five. Well, then you get into, you know, where you're going to end up in conference. You know, we we got to go just game by game, day by day right now. But, you know, you, you saw a Wyoming team that really was, we I felt we had them on, on the ropes. Mm. Um, they, they had some, some pretty good character kind of show up in that game and, and pull that win out, and then they went on a good run, won eight or nine games. Um, so I don't think we're very far off with competing with everyone in the conference. We just got to gotta believe it, and we got to treat every step of our day that way. Okay, now taking a look at the final uh, part of the schedule, you guys finally get a bye in there. But, um, and for the most part, too, most of these games, you're going to get some of the top teams in the conference here at home except for maybe ending the game for the first time <clears throat> in a long time i can't remember ending the season away yeah so yeah that's something none of us are used to um getting the bye in there was important we get it a little bit towards the end but we appreciate the mountain west understanding some of our travel travel uh, issues or um and not giving us back-to-back -back road games for the academic reasons for our kids so mm -hmm. that's that's one thing that we, that, that every year I've been here, that's been the case, so I appreciate that. Let's take a look at the full schedule now. Sure. Um, all 13 games, there you have it. Uh, you finish at San Diego State. I'll be able to see my daughter who goes oh, to the University good. of San Diego, but uh, we'll spend Thanksgiving up there, as I'm sure you guys will probably too. Mm -hmm. But uh, tell me just your overall thoughts on the 2018 schedule. Well, you got two military academies you're looking at. You have to do some option work in the spring. Um, there has to be some walkthroughs in the summer to get your option defense ready. Uh, Colorado State has some new staff changes. Um, so getting them for, you know, they lose the quarterback, they lose the great receiver. Mm -hmm. um, you know, open it up on the road at their stadium. I think game one, there's always, there's always surprises. And, um, you know, it'll be a little bit different getting the conference going in week zero or the first game of the year. But, um, I think it was what the best move for our team to get that buy in there. Okay, we're going to keep coach around a little later. We're going to talk about uh, spring ball starting up. Coming up. You got uh, coming up. You got new coaches. You got a new offensive scheme. You got uh, some new players coming in. We're going to talk all uh, about all of that a little later on in the show. Thank you. For, appreciate it. Yeah, let's stick around. Stick around. All right, coming up.